Well, it is a major blunder at Texas State University that led students to believe the number of rape cases was nearly five times less than what it actually was. Bryce Newberry is here now to explain how that mistake happened and how Texas State is trying to correct it. Bryce? Mike, when Texas State University in San Marcos released crime data for 2016 and 2017, they reported eight rape cases in the two years combined. Last night, the school released revised data, now revealing that there were actually 38 rape cases during that same time frame. It shows that it's still an issue, and it's not just the issue, it's a big issue. Sydney Jackson is in her freshman year at Texas State University. That's one of the things in college that students shouldn't be worried about. Shouldn't, students shouldn't have to be worried about being sexually assaulted. But new data released Monday by Texas State University reveals there were 38 rape cases in 2016 and 2017. Originally, the university reported there were only eight during the same time frame. We understand it's troubling for our university. University. Um, it's troubling for us. We, um, our priority is the safety, security, and peace of mind of our community. Sandy Pantlick is Assistant Vice President for Communications and University Advancement. She says three issues contributed to the reporting mishap. First, she says the records management system miscalculated cases. Second, groups across the university didn't have clear direction for reporting such cases. And third, the school's former police chief lacked experience in leading a university police department. Our biggest takeaway is that we will continue to improve these processes. That's welcome news for students like Matthew Swearingen. I'm glad that attention was brought to it and that it has been has been fixed. The heightened attention will keep students like Jackson looking out for her classmates. You just got to always be aware of your surroundings. You got to always be the helping hand. As a result of all this, the university says it started a Clary Compliance Committee. The Clary Act is a federal mandate that colleges report crimes on campus and in surrounding communities. Failing to comply means schools could lose out on financial aid programs. So far, Texas State says they have not been informed of any fines or changes to funding. Bryce Newberry, KVU News.